call to use my tarot unicorn Drew Craft Tarot Deck and the Romance Angel. So, question is. relationship and you want to know if it's going to become a serious relationship and what do you expect from this whole thing experience so here we are now with all your cards on the table and I have pulled them out and I will tell you exactly what they all mean. So it does tell me that you um, have a new love, you know, a new romantic, you know, adventure, romantic feelings, you know, and you're actually attracting that. You know, and, and you enjoy, you need to enjoy the moment, okay? And you know, this um, the reason I'm saying that is because you seem to be still thinking about the past relationships, and you can't like you need to let go of that, okay? Um, I'm not sure if that's you or that person, but there is someone, one of you two, have some faults you know, wearing a mask in this relationship. It's not being honest about something. Um, you know, you do have friends, so do trust and accept their support and help because you do need to talk. You need to talk and maybe your friends can help you uh, in releasing the past, okay? Release your ex, you see? It's time to clear that energy, and you seem to it's still holding on to that. Maybe it could be because you haven't finished, you know, um, you haven't finished yet what uh, your case, you know, you're still dealing with that. So it is kind of hard to let go when you are still dealing with that person. Um, I did ask if your relationship is gonna go further or any serious at the moment it told me no but remember we can always change this and the reasons why no we got again the emperor the magician the six of cups okay now going back to you know the in your past you thinking past this person could be reminding you of your ex Maybe things that he do, he probably, he, he looks like he's a person that, it's a power, okay? It looks like this person, uh, it's, uh, works hard, works a lot of hours, and he has some tricks under his belt, okay? So he's got, got some hidden things that he's not telling you. So going back to the deception card, okay? That's, somebody's wearing a mask. He's probably not being completely honest. It hasn't opened up to you, or could be you have not opened up to him completely because you still haven't released your ex. So you know your situation here, and once you get this read, you'll know who is this, who is the one who is wearing the mask, or you or him. Okay, because if you know, you know if you're wearing the mask, you know it's you, right? But if you're not the one wearing a mask, you know he's probably got something hiding from you. So that is the reason why it told me no. Again, we know that when we when we have a read on cards, we can always change that. And uh, how can we change that? By changing our attitude. And if it's you the one who, who are maybe, uh, you know, the one who are having it's not completely open to him and you have these memories from the past okay 
okay past relationships you know release your ex if this is you you can change that very easy by releasing this by working on yourself okay and enjoying the moment um, on the new relationship don't compare him to anybody because this is a new person okay it's a totally new person a new love okay you see new love and you know enjoy the moment you know uh, so don't compare this person to your exes at all there's a new person completely and if this person respects you that is so important if they respect you and they care for you and they they do you know they are good to you you know that is very important if you feel the attraction to each other that's also very important um, going back to my other cards here I also have um, the five cups okay <laughs> the four of cups and I have uh, the moon again you know you're dwelling and crying on things uh, without appreciating what you got right now okay so you got good things either it's you or him okay one of you two it's dwelling and, and just crying about things from the past well, time to stop that okay you know what you got something you or him got something good okay which if it's you he's a good one and take it you know take it um don't go back into the shadows and the reflections of the past it's just so clear that and i have a feeling this is you to be honest with you i don't think it's him i really think this is you i that's the feeling i get um you know um i feel that you are afraid on you know you have something good and now you are a little bit afraid uh, because you had bad experiences in the past and you cannot believe that now you may have something good and you know a lot of us what we do we sabotage ourselves on that because we think too much we think too much we think too much think too much <laughs> we think too much okay so time to let go okay release and let go and you can ask your friends to help you in that you know have fun enjoy yourself enjoy the moment okay enjoy the moment it is so important to just live today don't think too much about the future. Don't think about them, especially when you just met somebody. Get to know that person. Don't rush, you know. Get to see his beautiful qualities, okay? Now, if this person is doing things that reminds you a lot of your exes, then that will be also a warning to that this is not the right person, okay? So if this person is not treating you well and he's got like, you know, you get the little warning flags that uh, actions that were like your ex and you're reminding you. So it could be too that you're just aware, you're being aware of that and you're being cautious. So you know, again, you know your situation. So after I do this read, you will totally understand what I mean, okay? I will pull another card and let's see what the other card will tell us okay so i pull two more cards for you because i wanted to just you know clarify and i do believe this is for you this is you you know uh the queen of air you know it means it's uh objective decisions making clear way of what no longer serves you you need to let go let go let go let go and the other one you know and i just decided to pull one more archangel gabriel so we're going to ask Arch archangel gabriel to help you and you need to look into a, in a different perspective you know and it's important 
to be yourself okay so these two cards again it's it, it's clarifying what the other cards were telling us you know let go clear what doesn't need you no more let it go you know and be more objective be more uh, not objective be more um uh positive you know and, and you know it's okay to stand still for a bit take your time no rush you know but be yourself it is important to be yourself and just you know be clear about things and, and get rid of stuff that doesn't you don't need no more and see life with a more positive and humor situation so enjoy if you are seeing somebody and you this person you're really enjoying this person don't compare that person to the others okay don't do that no more enjoy this person for who that person is i hope you enjoyed this read love and light namaste